95% of the people you know out there want you to play it safe. They don't want you to jump over fire. You can get burnt. They don't want you to live the life that you were born to live. You've got to remember that if you're cooking food, you want to love it. You don't want to be thinking, oh, I don't want to have to prepare another meal for my husband who doesn't appreciate it. I don't have to prepare another meal for my wife who just doesn't care. She just wants peanut butter on toast. Wake the heck up. You are where you're at right here, right now, because of all the choices you have made up to this point. Now, I didn't know what to do with being blown up. I didn't know what to do with that until the psychologist told me, you're going to have post-traumatic stress disorder, Karen. I went, okay, great. Now, at least I know what to do with that. Well, other people are just walking through fire. Don't worry. The reality is, no one else is going to care enough about you to help you make this change until you care enough about you to help you make this change. I'd say it's awesome and it's the start of changing your life. There's something there that you want that you haven't been doing for yourself.